On July 23, 2012, we narrowly avoided a catastrophe of global proportions. On that day, the sun unleashed a colossal cloud of magnetized plasma, a coronal mass ejection, or CME. This wasn't just a flash of light. It was a physical storm of solar particles, rocketing through space at over 6 million miles per hour. Scientists classify this as a Carrington-class superstorm, putting it on par with the legendary 1859 event. Back then, a similar storm-fried telegraph systems started fires in offices and lit up the night sky with auroras seen as far south as Cuba. But a Carrington-level event today would be infinitely more devastating. Experts warn it could overload national power grids, causing cascading blackouts that could last for months, even years. GPS, satellite communications, and the internet would all be at risk. The global economic cost? Potentially trillions of dollars. So, what saved us? Pure cosmic luck. The eruption occurred on a part of the sun that was not facing Earth. Had it happened just one week earlier, our planet would have been directly in the crosshairs. We know how powerful this storm was because we had an eyewitness, NASA's Stereo A spacecraft. It flew right through the storm's path and its data gave us a terrifying look at the bullet we dodged. The 2012 solar superstorm is a stark reminder of our technological vulnerability. A silent threat lurking just 93 million miles away.